I am going to honor this man before you guys because this man has been very instrumental for the success of my duck farm and my queen farm because he is the heart really to take care of all of these animals. here at our quail farm and we are feeding them because we don't want that these quails will go hungry because if they will be run out of food the egg production will really be affected that is why they have to be fed regularly with the correct kind of food I am referring to the quail layer mass because many of those who have tried to operate this kind of farming have failed because they are feeding with chicken layer mass and uh, that is not the right kind of food because the chicken layer mass has lower protein content and the uh, quails need high protein content of kind of food. I am feeding now with this quail uh, layer mass here and the purpose is for them to continue on laying eggs. As what I have said in my previous videos, I am collecting an average of 1,800 eggs per day. So, later this afternoon, these quails will start laying eggs again. Many have viewed our videos. They said, okay, I will buy your quail eggs. And this is it right now. Maybe I have to expand. I have to double the population of our quail farm. Maybe by the next couple of months, we're going to reach 4,000 hen layers. By the way, these are all hen layers. There's no cocks here. They are all female quails. They are all layers. Today, I would like to share to you that the, one of the importance for the success of this farming is you have to have a trusted employee, a trusted individual who will really take care of the needs of this quail. And I'd like to introduce to you my very own uncle. I am going to honor this man before you guys because this man has been very instrumental for the success of my duck farm and my quail farm because he has the heart really to take care of all of these animals and uh, can you say hi to our friends? Hi, uh, I am Mr. Mr. Sergio Laban uh, Yes, uh, one of the caretaker what can you say about this uh, business? I, I know guys that this man is really have heart. No, you know, he has no family because his parents were all died and uh, he has no siblings. That is why I, I asked him to help me in this farm. You know, I'm living in a quite distant place from here. And I am just checking this once in a while and he's taking care of the feeds, of the, the water, the vitamins. That is why I'm very proud of this. Actually, he's my uncle. I've been helping him in all his needs. And I, I just don't know why he just liked the color of the hair, you know. Well, how what about this color of your hair? Did you intentionally have the color? Of course, if we are growing old, we must uh, quite uh, overhaul our uh, personality. The one that is uh, <laughs> kind of, of yes, uh, say that he is already old. How old are you? How old are you? I am uh, 72 years. He is 72 years old today. Oh. Today is your birthday? No, it's July. Ah, no, no, then July. Okay. But you know, uh, once you engage in farming, you have to select a trusted employee. And I owe 
a lot. You know, I've been sharing this man all the blessings that we produce out of this farming and uh, he just wanted to be dressed like this and <laughs> what's the significance of your hair in this quail farm? Uh, as I observed the quails uh, cannot forget me anymore they will uh, <laughs> meet me every morning every evening in time of feeding yeah he said he they are not already wild for me yeah, yeah. Oh, so they got acquainted with the color of your hair oh, and do it uh, do it Yes. Uh, well, more or less, he said that he wants to look unique so that every oh. time he comes in here, well, the, the, the quail will immediately recognize him. <laughs> And that's the purpose. Oh, any food I give them, they will just need to eat without any delay. Uh, inconvenience. Yeah, uh, yeah. inconvenience. And uh, he is a college graduate. He is a college graduate and uh, just retired from the service. And this is just a recreation for him. But I'm taking care of his meds and all of this stuff because he is old. And this is also in preparation for his future you know and uh, he is single actually uh, why did you not get married thanks to I think that is God's gift maybe yes uh, he said that that is his uh, gift gift, uh, gift of celibacy sometimes economic oppression this is all nice. Uh, very lucky. Yes, you're lucky. Uh, I was invited by my cousin, you know, you know that I was trusted to take care of these uh, animals. Uh, So guys, as what I've said, the success of this farm lies in the hands of this man and I honor him in front of you guys because I know that this will not become successful without his help, his support. And I'd like to honor him before you guys. I am too busy man. I am working in the government. I also have channel in this YouTube and of course these different farms. And this man has been my trusted employee ever since and he is here and I thank him and uh, hope guys you will like our videos and if you haven't yet subscribed please subscribe to our channel and uh, we are asking you to always follow us only here at Dixie's World you can, uh, you can see what you like 
Oh, yeah. So thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I am already the OIC. <laughs> <laughs>